Hi everyone, Rachel here. Um, I would like to share with you my application presentation. For my presentation, I chose the app and website Prodigy. Prodigy is a fantastic way to blend technology and learning skills together. Um, it is great to use at home for review, for practice, and also in the classroom for instruction time and also for practice for the students. It's also a great way to assess your students when it comes to math. Um, this is a game of adventure, um, but also math skills. So when you master a certain skill in math, you level up in the game and also in your skills. Here I have logged in using my Google account. Um, once I have logged in, I logged in as a teacher, um, and when I do that, it allows me to create a classroom. Here you have uh, my first period class, or what would be, um, and my class code. This is important if I want to invite my students or my parents to be involved. The wonderful thing about Prodigy is that when you invite your parents, they can log in and see the progress that their child is making. Prodigy in the classroom is really beneficial because you can, um, the students can access various levels based on their skill individually. So when you begin this process of starting Prodigy for your class, each student will take an assessment test. Um, when they do that, or a placement test as it says here, when they do that you will know their strengths and their weaknesses. And then they will begin with their weakest levels and try to master them and gain skill and until they master all of the skills in the math for their grade level. I'm going to click on this one right here and this shows your first through seventh grade students is what Prodigy is available to reach out to. Again, here's the class code if I need to give it to my students or teachers or parents, I'm sorry. And here it says reports. And this is the, the best part about this website for a teacher. So in the classroom, the other thing that Prodigy offers for a teacher is that it is designed specifically with units and lessons that we teach according to the Georgia Standards of Excellence. Um, it shares the same content and we are able to teach math skills um, while using this technology which follows the TPAC model. So my assessment of this website and the game that is offered is that um, parents can be invited and involved, which is fantastic. Um, there are ways to communicate so that way we can monitor our children. It's easily accessible. You can manage practices, game, um, and math skills at home or at school. Um, all you have to do is have access to the internet and your login. Um, I'd like to show you here the benefit of the dashboard that this website shows. It shows that you can find a student's progress by grade level or the stream content, which is what they are actually learning or what math level they are practicing at. Here we have student comprehension, an in-depth look at a particular student's progress and prodigy. Student usage and over view of the time that they are spending at home and school on the website. Also, their weekly activity, so we can find out what they are actually working on. Here is the placement test that each student will need to take before they begin. Also, your topic coverage and your curriculum coverage, which are very important when it comes to matching the levels of the game with the guided instruction that the teacher uses in the classroom. All right. Um, after playing this game with my children for um, an hour or so last night, um, I actually talked to some students that I knew have played this game before. 
and I got some feedback on it and their perception of the game um, and the learning part of aspect of Prodigy. Um, they enjoyed that you can battle your peers, that the game is very competitive, um, so you can actually get into a battle with someone who's with you, um, like a live game. Um, you can also personalize your characters and adopt pets on there that can basically travel with you um, as you go to battles. And um, not only are you applying your skills while you're learning, but it's a combination of math and adventure. Um, it really is an adventure game that reaches out to um, kind of the student's creative side. So that ends my tutorial on the game Prodigy. Um, if you'd like to find this online, you can go to www.prodigygame.com. Thanks for watching.